A new body camera video today shows Wheat Ridge police catching suspects accused of trying to steal cars, phones and store products. Our Nicole Fierro learning the key factors in making these arrests. She joins us live now with more Nicole. Yeah, these property crimes are happening in all of our local communities. Just yesterday, we were in Green Valley Ranch and Montbello capturing footage showing people trying to break into cars, both locked and unlocked. Well, Wheat Ridge police here say in the videos you're about to see, there's two key things leading to their success. Fueling up at the pump recently took a turn for a driver in Wheat Ridge. He called police reporting someone trying to get into his car. We got a good suspect description and somebody was able to uh, see that suspect go into some neighborhoods to the east of that area. Stop. Come here. Get this down. is what happened Stop. minutes later. I have him in the front yard. Relax. Get on your stomach. On your stomach. That suspect Relax. taken into custody and this officer there in time to spot the man throw a bag over the fence. We went through the bag that he tossed over the fence and we found some stolen property there, including three cell phones. Three stolen cell phones from three other victims bumping charges up to a felony level offense. Success. Wheat Ridge Police's public information officer credits that caller's quick description and because we have a fully staffed patrol team uh, that's really helped with our response time. <laughs> description of someone that stole things from King Supers. Another good quick description and adequate staffing leading to police getting on this RTD bus getting this suspect. Having members of the community who are just frankly sick of, of seeing this repeatedly over and over and calling us and saying, hey, I, I've seen this guy. He walks straight out of the store. If we have an officer in that area, when that happens, we can take advantage of that opportunity being in the right place at the right time. Fanning out officers in hotspot areas to focus on Wheat Ridge's biggest problem. We've seen a 10% increase in theft in Wheat Ridge so far this year. And last year it was a five year high. We have more boots on the ground. We have more people on the streets and then we can use those resources to be proactive. So authorized strength for the Wheat Ridge Police Department here is 87 sworn officers with their six uh, cadets in the academy. They're two over that. We also reached out to Denver Police and Aurora Police for their staffing numbers. Uh, they definitely do have some vacancies. We have all the data how many vacancies for each department on this story on our website. Reporting live here in Wheat Ridge, Nicole Fierro, Fox 31.